I think some of founder success comes from, from the very struggles and the story that exists and how we came to be. We just kept going and there was always a roadblock, but we never accepted the roadblock. For me, it was a, a very difficult time because Talk about it. You're completely just tunnel vision. It's what do I have to do today so I can get to tomorrow? You know, I was going out doing sales calls and I was just dull the whole time. You weren't excited about anything, you're just tired. It took us until we got pushed to the point of, of bankruptcy when we realized if we're going to go down, we're going to do it on our own terms. We're gonna do this our way. When I think of founders, it's like they allow you to be you, and I think their beer is that way too. Their beer is what they wanna be, and they don't make excuses. Each taste should be about what's real to know that you're trying to do something creative and something original and something challenging. There's a lot of companies that kind of just shove down the throats of their customers like, okay, you're supposed to wear this and you're supposed to drink this and you're supposed to do this. Founders have never been that. All of a sudden we realized that we weren't alone. There's a huge group of people that demanded more out of their beer. Dave and I talk about this dream, and we truly believed it was our dream, and we owned that dream, and there was nobody that could tell us when to shut the valve on. It's not about how big are you gonna get. It's about a group of individuals that would not take no for an answer. Ultimately, we want other people to grab life, embrace everything that you do. Founders is more than just beer. It's that feeling. There's more power in letting it go to the hands of everybody, and we all guide this ship together. <laughs>